in response to the YouTube video, Painting Pools, Things You Should Know, the question is, what brand of paint do you recommend to paint pools? Epoxy, right? If you've never had the pool painted before, if you have a plaster finish, and you're, you're in an environment where you can keep the pool empty and dry for a long time, meaning if you're not in a low spot, if there's not a lot of groundwater, if you, if you can keep it fairly dry, I would recommend an epoxy paint for sure. If you, uh, the quick and down and dirty would be to use uh, uh, just a regular rubber-based pool paint. There's, there's several different manufacturers. I, I wouldn't tell, I couldn't tell you which one I think is better or not. They each have their own advantages. You can do a quick, research on that and figure out which ones would be the best ones for you but if the pool has been painted before you have to know what type of paint was used before and use that same type of paint meaning if it was a rubber-based paint you always want to put a rubber-based paint over rubber-based paint if it was an epoxy paint you're going to want to put epoxy over it you never want to mix brands i don't think matter so much but the base uh matters so just make sure that Whatever you're doing, if it's a first time painting and it's never been painted before, then you can use any kind of paint you want. You just have to look at how long it's gonna to take to dry and how long can you keep the shell dry before putting water in it and is that safe to do based on weather, based on groundwater issues. All of those things can cause a whole bunch of different problems. So I, I think brand of paint is less important than understanding what the substrate, what's underneath there, and the hydraulics, and is this thing gonna stay in the ground when you're leaving it empty to paint it. So um, I hope that helps you.